Hello, B. Debricks here, back with another video. Today we have finally another video after like so, so long, like roughly a month, I would say, like three weeks again. But for this showcase, we have 6-6 six, six from Ben 10 Original Series, and we have a special figure from Alien Extinction from the reboot. So without further ado, let's get into it. Alright, so starting off with this minifigure, we have 6-6. Six, six. He is painted in a dark purple. Not too, too dark, but a medium medium darkish purple then i painted a light purple for his pouches and his ammo pouches because he does have a lot of alien tech let me just get this around where it has more beetle texturing and like i sculpted on basically everything you see on this figure that doesn't look lego i sculpted it on have more of those beetle pouches right here his jetpack is completely painted by me painted in silver and detailed by me too with an exacto knife or exacto blade whatever you want to call it i have sculpted and painted two of these on these sides pouches two knee pouches then one on the side his black boots are painted his silver armor is painted the purple purple ammo pouch purple ammo pouches on his chest is sculpted head is sculpted it's really strange i had to use um you know, like one of those cylinder pieces and then sculpt on top of it because his head shape is really, really weird. I would say, and his, and his eyes are outlined in pink. Yeah, that's about it. There's really nothing much, honestly. This, was whole, this, was, this whole thing was sculpted and painted by me. Let's move on to Alien X. All right, next off we have here is Alien X from the Benton special Alien Extinction. So his eyes are painted in green, and it has a spring green in the middle. I sculpted and painted on the Omnitrixes, or Omnitrices, whatever you want to call it. Painted him black and white, and then I painted on the stars on him. And according to the reference art, this is com made completely different compared to the original Alien X, because it's from the reboot. Because, like, the original one didn't have, like, these crown they did have a crown but like they didn't have it like detailed like this where it like you know you know what i mean it looks like more of like a trident i guess on my original alien x but now this one looks more like trident like i really don't know how to describe it then on this oh sorry i didn't mean to push it like that but we have painting on the white painting on the side we have all the omnitrix is painted on the left then moving this to the right, same thing on the other side. The back, it's nothing much, just painted black and white. The arms are partially sculpted, and the hands are glued outwards to, and painted on in white and some more star patterns. This is supposed to be for an accessory that's for the future. I plan to give him like an accessory of a green power blast. Or something similar. So it matches with the figure. This is made out of one of those ball jointed minifigures. I don't know how well it's going to work. Considering you know. It's heavily painted. But I don't even think this can move that well. So I'm kind of scared that you know. You know. Move it. But you can get him in some poses. Like this for example. I don't know if you can move the body that well. I probably need to sand it down a little. Maybe. I really don't know if I should bend this. Because this has a lot of painting on it. But yeah. You can get him in a pose like this. Where he's just flying. You can get him in a pose like. Where he's in the show. Where he's going backwards. With Ben's Omnitrix. Where you reboot Ben's Omnitrix. Where you can have him like this. Put him like this. Then have a leg up. Then you can have his legs push back. Push his legs back. Then he's, you know, put it like that. He's kind of tilted at the moment. Let me give him one second. There we go. You could have him like this, where he's like scooting back with Ben's Omnitrix. But other than that, it's, it's really nothing much, honestly. It's just one of those knockoff minifigures with, the, um, you know, ball, joint, ball joints. So, overall, that's it for this showcase. Thank you all so much for watching. Oh wait, before we do that, I actually have one updated minifigure that's almost finished, so let's get to it. Alright, originally I was going to make some FNAF movie customs, 
but unfortunately that didn't come to fruition because I got like running free tran running free separate channels is really hard. I will say that it's disaster, especially when people make shit up about you. It gets really difficult, so I just I was like decided like, hey, f, f it, I'm not gonna bother with it. Just wasting my time. So yeah, here is Bonnie from Five Nights at Freddy's. He's still in the process of getting painted. I need to outline his bow tie. Because it's a little bit too bright and it blends in too well. And I need to paint his eyes. And you just need to paint the white shine in his eyes. But other than that, he's basically finished. Probably going to outline the bow tie in dark red. But yeah. For other customs I have planned, I have Eye Guy planned and a few other ones from Benton. But then after that, all of, after all of the Benton original classic series figures are made, I'm probably going to take a break and go back to FNAF maybe, but I'm not entirely sure because the community is kind of, you know, like a really bad state at the moment. But yeah, overall, that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.